elder mother is gonna enjoy getting her freak on on ritual night with Lacey. And I'm telling you, if evil had a face, it would be elder mothers. And would you believe that I used to have empathy for this woman? Y'all remember when the highest used to slap her around and just, you know, throw paper, throw paper at her that hit her all in her face? I used to really feel sorry for her. And, and, and I know, I know she's evil, you know, but at that time she wasn't being evil. She just looked really pitiful, right? But now she's definitely back to her evil ways and she's gonna use Lacey to do what she can't do, which is give the highest some children. And she's carrying this out in the most evil of ways. She's going to actually orchestrate all of these men coming in to see Lacey, right? And, you know, she tried to give Lacey this candy that would help her to relax, right? And enjoy it more, to endure more with these men, these older men. And she told us that the men would be older because the highest let her know that he didn't want to have anything to do with her children because she was a traitor. So instead of giving her the highest seeds, she has to be seeded by men that have not been enlightened, which Elder Mother already told us that she wants to use the older men for this, which is further humiliation for Lacey. I mean, it's all humiliating, but it's like, okay, like what's your end game here? I know she's gonna be sitting there with this smirk on her face, enjoying every moment. I've already said that her and the highest, they really relish in watching people suffer. I mean, she's already setting this up, getting everything together. She went to the pavilion, made sure all the men had their blue cards. <laughs> And I think that this is a clear indication of the blue pill instead of the blue card because, you know, we already know that she loves giving out medications, right? Ones that will help you, quote unquote, stay in the moment. She wants to make sure that these men are going for like an extra long time. Like, what are you trying to do? Are you trying to kill this girl? Like, for real? Because if she's dead, she won't be able to produce any babies. Like, she, this is like the ultimate sacrifice if you will like there is absolutely no way and i don't think that zane is going to be able to take this because she's going to be in the room remember i don't know if she's going to be able to stand and endure lacy going through all of this torture and then watching it and then not only that she has to pretend that she is on elder mother's side so that's not going to be easy for her to do but there's a flip side to all of this we know that Lacey is a straight up G, right? And she's got a smart mouth. So I know that she's not going to be able to just lay there and take it and not say anything to Elder Mother or try to do something. I'm telling you, this red scarlet robe, uh, it, it's, it's already started bringing her bad luck, you know, in the worst way. Elder Mother is making sure that no one talks to her, that no one helps her, that she's gonna be in chains for the rest of her life. And Lacey said that she'd rather be dead, you know, than to live under those conditions. Boy, I'm telling you, if it were me, as soon as Elder Mother got just a little bit close to me while I was laying on that bed, those chains would be going around her neck, okay? And I would sit there and hold them until she's no longer breathing. <laughs> You just got to take her out because she's not going to stop. I mean, you have to fight evil with evil, right? There are so many other ways that you can punish someone, but Elder Mother choose to punish her through these lewd acts with men because she's a freak. She's a freak. And we found out that she's already been freaking leaking with, with all the men on the compound. Well, at least 21 out of 26 of them, right? So she's doing this to satisfy her own sick pleasures. But I'm anticipating this ritual because I really want to just see how Lace is going to react because I just love seeing her be defiant <laughs> and just going against the grain. So that's why I just want to see her fight back. So th that's what I'm looking forward to. Draw me your comments below and let me know what you're looking forward to with Lacey's ritual. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. You know I'd appreciate it. And if you're a fan of Tyler Perry's Ruthless, go ahead and sub to this channel for more videos just like this one. Thank you so much for joining me today on Ruthless TV, you guys, and I'll see you on the next one.